place to get away. It's a time to step back and take a breath. Beautiful places to pray. Beautiful places to really reflect. When I'm at Montserrat, I feel a profound sense of peace, of silence, of stepping away from the busyness and the hecticness of the world so that I can hear God's voice and hear it clearly. From an Ignatian standpoint, St. Ignatius says that prayer happens best when you're removed from distractions. So one of the things that Montserrat offers is a place that is safe from distraction. The world can deplete us. I feel that this is a place where you can fill up again, where you can be filled with God's love. And when you're full of God's love, it overflows and you're able to love again. And you're able to love in a bigger, better way. Retreats at Montserrat have been very effective in affecting my life. And the thing that is most important about it is the silence. Si ustedes escuchan por ahí una invitación a esta casa de retiros, asistan. No lo duden. Todas las personas necesitamos estar en silencio en algún momento de nuestra vida. One thing that I really like about Ignatian spirituality is that it really values your own feelings. There's a profound respect for how you feel about something that you're trying to discern. And St. Ignatius says, no, trust your feelings, listen to them, because God's will oftentimes is manifest through those feelings. It's so important in our busy world to stop and take inventory, to see where we've been and where God is calling us and where we are currently. No better place to do that than on the grounds of Montserrat. Montserrat is a jewel hidden in the north side of the Dallas area that we must tell other people about. Because once you go there, you want to go back and you want to go back and you want to go back. Sino que todo esto que nosotros adquirimos lo llevamos a nuestros hogares y lo transmitimos a nuestras familias. Y no solamente en nuestras familias, también en nuestros trabajos. I would recommend do one, just do one, and see if it has that effect on you that it did on me.